the Sri Govindram Sexaria Institute of Technology and Science, GSTI, is a public engineering institution located in Indore, India. It was established in 1952 as a technical institute offering licentiate and diploma courses in engineering. It is considered among the best engineering college in Madhya Pradesh including IIT Indore and MANIT Bhopal. The institute offers nine undergraduate and 17 postgraduate courses with an intake of 660 and 150 students respectively. At any time, there are approximately 2640 undergraduate students studying in the institute. In addition, part-time degree courses are offered for working professionals with engineering diploma. It is an autonomous college seeking university status. SGSITS is an academically and administratively autonomous institute, however, it is a part of the Rajiv Gandhi Pradyogi Vishwavidyalaya and its degrees are issued by the university. All India Council of Technical Education, New Delhi and University Grants Commission, New Delhi granted the status of an autonomous institution in 1989 under this status. The institute conducts its own examinations at both UG and PG levels SGSITS became operational under the administration of a board of governors. History, when established, it was known as Sri Govindram Sexaria Kalabhavan. The institute came into being as a result of the desire expressed by the Prime Minister Jawaharlal Nehru to a group of leading industrialists of Indore for establishment of a technical institute. An industrialist of the town, Seth Shrika de Largi Sexaria, responded by donating the initial amount for starting the institution in the name of his late father Seth Shrika of Indram Sexaria. In 1956 it was converted to a degree college with a course in civil engineering and its name was changed to Shrika of Indram Sexaria Technological Institute, Indore. With the introduction of MSc. Courses in Applied Sciences the name of the institute was changed to its present name. In 1989 the institute was granted autonomous status by the University Grants Commission and the AICTE. Achievements The institute's 50-year celebration was held on December 22, 2002, which is now called SGSITS Day. His Excellency the President of India Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam was the chief guest. The President unveiled the foundation stone of Advanced Technology Center to mark the ceremony and later in the day addressed students and faculty. Academic and cultural activities were organized to celebrate the Golden Jubilee year. The Institute celebrated its Diamond Jubilee in the year 2013 completing 60 years of academic contributions. SGSITS has been constantly ranked among the top 30 to 50 technical institutes of India by various independent bodies. The institute also received help when the Government of India was implementing its Technical Education Quality Improvement Program with the help of the World Bank. The institute received 10 crore of rupees from the Government of India and the World Bank. The funds were used for construction of the building of Advanced Technology Centre, renovation of the building of Central Library, installation of campus-wide network of computers with connectivity to the Internet, modernization of Central Library modernization of departmental laboratories and to fund initiatives like postgraduate education by video conferencing and the opening of an information technology incubation center. Recently the institute has received a grant of 12.5 Indian rupees crore under TEQIP phase II. This grant is mainly for upgradation of postgraduate education in the institute. Campus, the institute is located in the heart of Indore, a few minutes from the railway and bus stations at the New Park Road the land area of the institute is 35 acres while the building area is 85,000 square meters. There are two blocks in the institute. One is residential block, where staff quarters and hostels, guest house situated. Second is the academic block, where all the departments situated. Staff quarters, one director quarter, six professor quarters, 24 lecturer quarters, 14 readers quarters, 30 quarters for class 3 and 4 employees. There are 7 hostels, 4 boys hostels, Vishveshwarya hostel for first year undergraduate students, H. Babha hostel for second year undergraduate students, J. C. Bose hostel for third year undergraduate students, C. V. Raman hostel for final year undergraduate students. 2 girls hostels, 
one transit hostel for research scholars, lecturers and sponsored students, each hostel has a mess of its own. There is a guest house for 20 persons. The institute has football and cricket grounds, basketball, and volleyball courts. It also has a sports complex which has badminton and table tennis courts. The institute also has a gymnasium gifted by 1986 batch. Admission, till 2013, admission to this institute at undergraduate level was done on the basis of MP PET. Currently, the institute offers admission on the basis of student performance in joint entrance examination. At postgraduate level, the admissions are on the basis of GATE. Admissions to the Master of Computer Applications course is done on the basis of MPMCA examination. Admission to the MSc. Courses is conducted at the department level. Admission to the MBA courses is done by DAVVCET examination. Academic departments, at present, the institute offers 10 undergraduate and 17 postgraduate courses with an annual intake of 660 and 375 students respectively including Master a Euro Unregistered Trademark S degree in Applied Sciences and Pharmacy. MCA course with annual intake 60 students is being offered since 2000 to 2001. The institute runs five part-time degree courses with intake of 30 students in each. The institute offers nine undergraduate courses, mechanical engineering, computer engineering, electrical engineering, electronics and telecommunication engineering, civil engineering and applied mechanics, electronics and instrumentation engineering, information technology, industrial and production engineering, biomedical engineering, there are 17 postgraduate courses. The Ministry of HRD of the Government of India has identified the Civil Engineering Department as a Centre for Quality Improvement for PhD degrees and the Electrical Engineering Department for ME degree. Teaching and related activities of the Institute are taken care by departments, centres and cells of the Institute. The departments are, Mechanical Engineering, Computer Engineering, Electrical Engineering, Electronics and Telecommunication Engineering, Civil Engineering and Applied Mechanics, Electronics and Instrumentation Engineering, Information Technology, Industrial and Production Engineering, Pharmacy, Biomedical Engineering, Applied Biology, Applied Physics, Applied Mathematics and Computational Science, Applied Chemistry, Computer Technology and Applications, Centers and Cells are, Computer Center, Center for Continuing Education Program, Entrepreneurship Development Cell, Training and Placement Cell, Central Workshop and Management Cell, Center for Nanotechnology Center for Lasers and Fiber Optics Center for VLSI Designs Entrepreneurship Development, Cell Center for Advanced Automation Center for Industry Institute Interaction, Remote Sensing Cell, Reservation Policy. SGSITS has an affirmative action policy on caste and gender-based reserved quotas. 16% of the admitted students must be of the scheduled castes, 20% of seats are reserved for scheduled tribes and 14% for the other backward classes. Remaining 50% seats are open for all students. In case a reserved category student get good marks he will be in allotted open category seat. In each of the above categories 30% of the seats are reserved for girls. Reservations are also for J and K, NRI, Handicap, Wards of Freedom Fighter and Wards of Sainik. There are also reserved seats for the son-daughter of Army personnel serving in Army. Notes External links, Official Website